Michael McFadden may have had a tumultuous love life with his on-screen wife Shiv Roy in succession but in real life, it's quite the opposite. Michael McFadden's on-screen performance as Tom Wamsgans in HBOS Succession has earned him an Emmy nominee. The 49-year-old actor had the fans on the edge of their seats as they watched his character's marriage to Shiv Roy, played by Sarah Snook, brutally break down. Throughout the series, the fictional pair faced various setbacks riddled with backstabbing, twists and drama. Even their wedding in the season 1 finale, what should have been the happiest day of their lives, was clouded with scandal, from Shiv attempting to conceal an illicit affair to receiving oral sex from a prostitute on his stag do. But luckily for Matthew, his love life off the screen is nothing more than a fairy tale. Away from the screen, Matthew is happily married and loved up with his former Spooks co-star Keely Hawes, 47, with the pair now being married for 19 years. The showbiz couple first met in 2002 when they co-starred in the BBC spy drama Spooks, which is known as Me 5 in the States. At the time she was newly married to DJ Spencer McCallum, with whom she shares 23-year-old son Miles. The couple's work friendship later blossomed into something more and she went on to divorce Callum in 2004, before marrying Matthew later that year. They later welcomed two children of their own, daughter Maggie, 19, and son Ralph, 17. Speaking about the magical moment they first said the L word, the bank job actress recalled, Matthew just came straight out with it and said I love you in the rain one day. I thought, oh dear, here we go. The couple have continued to work together and starred in the 2007 comedy Death at a Funeral Together before working on Stonehouse in early 2023. The series followed Love Cheat Labour MP John Stonehouse, who faked his own death before running off with his mistress and later being exposed as a spy. While they have shared their fair share of acting roles, working together has now become rare, who revealed how they managed to keep their spark alive when torn apart on shoots. Matthew told The Evening Standard in 2021, Keely and I have a three-week rule, neither of us wants to be apart for any longer. So after three weeks on my own, I started to go a bit mad. You start to think, what am I doing? It'd be walking around Brooklyn, thinking, where do I live? It was odd and hard. For the two lovebirds, they'll do whatever it takes to go the distance, with Keely similarly telling The Telegraph in 2010. I love being married to Matthew, and I know Matthew loves being married too. It ties everything up and it's a statement to each other and to the world. Marriage and being a mother are absolutely crucial to my happiness and my life. 